Welcome to my channel. Please like, comment, and subscribe. How to get cheap travel insurance? A robust a travel insurance plan can help pay trip medical expenses, reimburse you for deposit lost if you have to cancel the trip, and much more. But you don't want the travel insurance bookcase to break the bank. The biggest price factor in travel insurance are total trip costs, your age, number of travelers, and the length of your trip. The average travel insurance costs in between 5% to 6% of your trip costs. According to a uh, Forbes advisor analysis, analysis of travel insurance rates. Here are some advice about finding cheap travel uh, insurance that still have good coverage. First, be savvy travel insurance uh, comparison shopper. As uh, with the most insurance comparing policies from multiple companies can potentially save you hundreds of dollars. Travel insurance policies often include most of the same benefits but the price and coverage amount can carry considerably by policy. Says Stephen Pena, a spokesperson uh, for Square, Square Mod, a travel insurance comparison provider, a travel insurance agent can help be help can be helpful. That a uh, person can uh, help identify the coverage you want and then price shop uh, the options. The second is understand exactly what can be insured under travel insurance. You can avoid overspending on a travel insurance plan by understanding exactly what you should. Uh, insure, says Pena. For example, it's uh, important to understand that trip cancellation insurance will only reimburse you for prepaid and non-refundable trip expenses. So don't buy coverage for the refundable parts of, uh, of your trips. And then, for example, if you booked uh, a hotel for five nights for a total of uh, five thousand US dollar, but the cancellation penalty is one thousand US dollar, you will insure the one thousand US dollar. You cannot make a travel insurance claim for a month that are refundable. The third, avoid unnecessary travel insurance coverage. Be cautious about buying coverage or upgrades that you likely don't need. For example, many travelers buy a cancel for a recent upgrade in addition to standard trip cancellation insurance. It adds, it adds an average of 50% uh, to the cost of your travel insurance plan. The upgrade gives you priority reimbursement for trip costs if you cancel for a reason not listed in the past policy. For example, canceling because you had a falling out with your traveling companion. As another example, you don't need baggage insurance for like 2,500 US dollar if you're packing 200 US dollar worth of t-shirts, shorts, and a swimsuit. You also may not need travel medical insurance if you are not leaving the country during your trip. You may, uh, this may be especially true if you will primarily be shopping, dining out, and sightseeing and not participating in a lot of outdoor activities like hiking and biking. Uh, your US health plan uh, will usually cover you if you become ill or injured during a domestic vacation. And if you are booking a trip last minute, trip cancellation might be less important. That's why it's a good idea to think about why you want travel insurance. Don't go with the policy with the most bells and whistles that you wouldn't need. Okay? Instead, explore which coverage would benefit you the most. The next is consider buying an annual uh, travel insurance policy. If you are taking one or two trips uh, a year, buying travel insurance for each one makes sense. But if you are planning multiple trips, buying a policy for each one gets uh, inconvenient and expensive. Annual travel insurance policies are primarily designed to provide travel medical insurance for multiple trips and at a better overall price. This type of annual policies can make it easier to buy just one policy instead of multiple ones and could be a travel insurance solution for people who plan to take multiple domestic flights. However, annual travel policies may not make sense if you are taking road trips. Basic annual policies uh, also offer limited trip cancellation insurance and trip uh, interruption co coverage. The next is check your credit card travel insurance benefits. Your credit card may offer travel insurance as a built-in perk. The key here is that you must charge the entire trip on that credit card. This benefit can include some cancellation coverage for trip expenses paid for with that card, in addition to, to coverage for luggage, says Vina. He points out that instead of paying for a travel insurance uh, policy, you can save money by relying on a credit card's cancellation benefits. If your trip ex expenses exceed uh, the credit card's coverage limit, you can buy travel insurance for a remaining amount, not Vina. This, uh, this will make the policy less expensive 
uh, than insuring the entire trip cost. The next is value of travel insurance should be more important than cost. Cost should not be the only factors when you are buying travel insurance, as if travel insurance policy that likes good benefits won't pay off in the end. For some people, medical coverage ma uh, matters most and baggage insurance is less important, especially if they're not planning to pack anything probable. Medical coverage is especially important if you are traveling overseas because uh, U.S. health plans may provide no coverage outside the U.S. and Medicare is not accepted outside the U.S. Of course, there are a lot of more than goes into travel insurance than medical protection, so make sure you get a policy that's right for you. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to give like, comment, and subscribe.